Alright, hello everyone, Simon here. Welcome back to our Minecraft Trains project. And uh, Wesley's back, he will be. So let's uh, continue building our confluence station. Also, is the mouse speed slower than before? That's weird. I guess it's not. Okay, so what was it doing? I was filling in the solid bits that I know about, right. Uh, hey Wesley, welcome back. Do you have any opinions? <laughs> Do you have any opinions on the progress? So what I... what am I doing? So like this for example, we're filling this in. This is gonna be a tunnel, right? Hi. Sandstone in there. Uh, Wesley says I like how it turned out so far. Well, good. So what do you... is there anything uh, you want to do? Any any area you've identified as something that you want to... I mean, there's the, the actual guarded bits on the outside. I'm just doing the structural bits on the inside. Before I want to get to that. But maybe... I don't know. Trees, water, paths... Terraforming, okay, well, if you want to have a go at that, let's see how that goes. And I will continue doing the structure bits. So some of the structure bits I'm not too sure about. And as you do the, the gardening bits, you might discover things that we need to do with the structure. Or maybe like the structure detailing? Because at the moment it's kind of bland on the outside, I don't know if we're going to put the garden in first, or put detailing in, or what. Anyway, I'm sure you can figure something out. <laughs> I'm just going let to you, let you decide. In the meantime... Oh, uh... I was thinking we're going to have a skylight on the roof too. I don't know if that's going to fit. Just an idea. Maybe like in the middle there'll be a skylight. Or more like a light well. So um, yeah, so not, not entirely solid. Completely, possibly, possibly also some light wells. Alright, so that's the tunnel bit there, the tunnel bit there. I mean, this is like empty underneath, don't know what to do there. Let me go to the other side, keep it symmetrical. Oh, hey, look at that. <laughs> yeah, the paths, it might make sense to raise the paths up. In, in parts. Nothing is fixed, everything is negotiable. So the uh, the idea is the the green and the blue water and plants will complement the yellow of the sandstone. All right, so this tunnel bit is filled in there. This tunnel bit is next. By the time all of this is closed up, it's going to be quite dark on the inside. It'll be uh, cave-like on the interior, I think. Which 
provides a contrast to the exterior, of course. Alright, so tunnel and tunnel. Um, uh, and then this bit is the same. The tunnel bit is solid. Oh, it's almost Christmas, huh? So I just looked at the calendar a little earlier. The next Sunday stream will be just before Christmas Eve. I uh, don't think I have any plans for Christmas. Observe. <laughs> Let's observe uh, Wesley filling in and flooding the interior. Wesley, <laughs> wait, what happened here? Wait, why does the water do that? What? Oh no, yeah, no, it's uh, the transparent blocks no longer. Stop the water. <laughs> hey, welcome to welcome to new Minecraft updates. <laughs> That's new. It's a new game mechanic. <laughs> that wasn't like that before. <laughs> uh, I guess this should be. I mean, no one's going to see that. It doesn't really matter. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty much half of the course, right? This is what we usually do. <laughs> so what happened there? So you can, can you like put, um, can you pour water buckets onto half blocks now? Is that what's going on? Like, you, you don't have to pour it into empty space. Water sources can share the same block as a transparent block. That is bizarre. What about, like, glass? Because glass is transparent. Can you like make a glass a source block? That you can't do that, right? <laughs> glass panes, yes, it's the weirdest thing. Although maybe we can make use of that effect in in our designs here. Hmm, let's think about that. So I was looking at the news this morning and they uh, just agreed on the on a new climate change rules for implementing the Paris Accord. I was trying to find the text of it, I guess it's still too early, they haven't published the, the actual text of what they agreed on. But apparently things like uh, how to measure progress towards climate change mitigation, how to measure reductions in carbon and all that. 
sounds super interesting, don't you think? <laughs> it's, a, it's a it's a highly technical legal document, <laughs> and I look forward to reading through it. Have I said here, like, what they're doing? I think I said it before, maybe you weren't here, Wesley. Talking about, like, the, uh, the IPCC reports, and what they say is necessary for us to, to actually avoid catastrophic climate change. So the scientists are talking about, um, uh, what do they call it? Biocombustion, carbon capture and storage. Right. Biocombustion, carbon capture and storage. Basically, it means that we have to plant trees. Well, not probably, probably like plants. Plants and uh, burn the plants. Capture the carbon dioxide from burning the plants and burying that carbon dioxide into the ground. So, so bio-combustion, carbon capture, and storage. <laughs> Which, uh, it sounds fascinating to me, but it's something that we haven't even started thinking about. So like not only capturing the carbon that we we get from burning fossil fuels and burying that in the ground, but removing carbon from the atmosphere by growing plants and then burning them and then burying burying that carbon dioxide in the ground as well. I think the uh, the public and the governments of the world are, are fairly behind in terms of their ambitions and and what they're prepared to do. Um. Okay, so I'm thinking about this. Some of these parts... Yeah, never mind, keep going. <laughs> hey, Cody. Uh, Wesley, some of these parts are thicker than others. So, I think they alternate, right? So some parts are only one block thick, as you've discovered there with the glass. So like this part is only one block thick. Actually, no, it's not. Wait a minute. No, Wesley, this, this can be solid underneath. So like th this down here, it's it's going, yeah. So this I was thinking, Wesley, will be like solid down to this level. So we can afford to have deeper landscaping. The only parts that aren't solid down is is underneath here, I suppose. Although, if you wanna... I mean, it doesn't have to be solid. We can leave it open. What do you think? I was thinking having it more massive. Kinda cramped bridge right now. Yeah... It is, it is quite cramped. But if it's solid, you can have the water go a little further down. Yeah, okay, good, good. I, I agree. I agree with your assessment. 
Hi Cody, things are things are being designed. <laughs> I'm not sure if well is the is the way I describe it. How are you, Cody? We're getting rather close to Christmas, huh? Oh, have I finished the other side? I'm just... I haven't finished the other side, alright. <laughs> One thing at a time. Cody says I'm great, that's good. So we get to here, and I guess we grasp this. Um, so anything with grass on it, it means that it's uh, sandstone underneath. The stuff with no grass, it means that it's not solid underneath, I suppose. Anyway, I'm pretty sure Wesley's going to remove the grass anyway. Yeah, I mean, you're gonna do the same thing on the other side, right? Uh, alright, so then here, sandstone... if we should invest in, in carbon capture technology. Carbon capture and storage technology. This is meant to be grass. There's not that many companies doing carbon capture and storage yet. And of course there's no money in it except if the government governments pay for it. Or rather, there's no market yet because the carbon market is not really that robust. But here's what I'm thinking. If, if we take effective action on climate change, then it makes sense to invest in carbon capture companies now because they'll make money. On the other hand, if we don't take effective action on climate change, then we're all going to die and it won't matter. <laughs> so, so, by that logic, we should invest in carbon capture technology companies. Is that really meant to be grass down there? It's probably not, right? The pool, yeah, the pool could be super deep. Oh, it's meant to be grass? Interesting. Interesting. The walls don't have to be flat either. We could put some texture into the walls. Anyway, one thing at a time. Uh, what was I up to? So I filled those two sides in. And then we're gonna fill all of this. And it's getting dark in here, isn't it? So all of this underneath here is gonna be filled.
I should put down some temporary lighting. 